Hey guys, it's Bernard. Today we're gonna make mustache cookies on a stick to go with this card with my friend Carrie. Woohoo! Can't wait! Today I'm joined by my really good friend Carrie who has brought a card and wants some cookies to go along with it. So Carrie, why don't you tell us about the card? Bernard, I brought a very special card. It says, it's your day and it focuses on a mustache. It's for my neighbor who has a handlebar mustache. He's in Perfect. a barbershop quartet and he's gonna have a performance. So I'm gonna give it to him and I'm gonna come in like that <laughs> to surprise him and then hopefully give him some cookies that are awesome. iced beautifully. Well, perfect. Well, in honor of this card, we are gonna make mustaches on a stick. So the cookies will go right along with that card. So we actually, as you can see, made some a mustache on a stick. We made a couple different varieties for you. A little tip for baking cookies on a stick, um, you just go to the grocery store, some skewers, some just regular old bamboo skewers. Um, really cheap, a couple dollars for a big pack. So I just use some everyday pruning shears to um, snip off the size that I need. Mm -hmm. um, you may not want to bring these in right out of the garden. The, <laughs> Give these, them a wash. These are just for cake, believe it or not. I use them a lot for that. So um, get that to the length you want. Lay it on a parchment lined cookie sheet. It's a little bit easier if you're baking on parchment. Then once you have cut the cookie out of the dough, lay it on top of the stick, and then you need to push down pretty firmly where that cookie meets the stick. That way the dough will adhere around the stick and hold on so that the cookie won't fall off. So we are ready to go and ice these cookies. Excellent. You ready? Ready. Okay, so we are gonna use royal icing. Okay. I just thin it down a bit, so you'll be able to see here how it's just kind of a really thin, uh, like, we can paint this, Got so it. that's Got the it. consistency. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how to do one, and then it'll be your turn, okay? So we're gonna also put sanding sugar on there, so you can get that at a cake decorating store, or grocery store. Mm -hmm. um, I have the big industrial size, normally it's a little <laughs> Small. bit smaller. Okay, so uh, I recommend when you are icing these with the stick, don't hold it by the stick and decorate because you're going to increase your chances that it breaks off. Okay. So we're just going to pretend the stick's not there. So when you're icing it, try to hold on to, this, to the cookie itself. So again, we're going to prime the brush and get it ready. So we load up the brush, uh -huh. you dab in the middle. Got it. It's wearing a mustache. Y yes, exactly. So then when you unload the brush there, then you pull from the center to the edge. So it's okay that the edges are getting a little bit of icing on them. Yep. And you're just going right around. Again, don't try not to hold the stick. But by pulling it off the side, it kind of gives you a cleaner edge mm -hmm. um, around the stick. Just kind of dab a little bit until it's all covered okay. like that. Then we're going to take the sanding sugar while it's still wet. Missed a spot. <laughs> um, so the sanding sugar, hold it low over the plate and just generously coat the cookie and then dump off the excess and there you have it. Cool. Now can you reuse that sugar? Yes, that's exactly why we do it on a paper plate. Okay. Um, so it. then at the end, we can just roll up the paper plate and dump it back in. Okay. So okay. you want to give that a try? Sure. Okay, there's that. You grab yourself a cookie. All right. So do I have to prime? No, I already primed. primed. So You're I'm primed. just dabbing. Yes. Or loading. You're going to unload there. Glob More. in the middle. Kind of an unorthodox. Yeah, a little bit. That's that how we do things think? here. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Now pull it. Let, let the bristles come off the edge. That gives you a nice clean edge. There, see? Perfect. Kind of a speed icer. There you go. I love that. Bit holding on to the stick. Don't notice that. So Carrie and I are lacrosse parents. Our sons play lacrosse together, so that's how we've gotten to know each other, and we have friendly baking competitions at the <laughs> at the games, right? I want you to guess who wins. Uh, well, she wins for packaging. <laughs> well, <laughs> right? okay, yes, I do have a vintage tin that I bring my items in. No, wait, when you sh did it, were you were you down on the plate like that? Yeah, you can do it like it? that. You can either hold it or do it down on the plate. A little frugal with my... No, be generous. Okay, okay, all right. Am I, is that... You look good. So tilt. Okay, and just lay it on Hey! The tray. Okay! 
Awesome. Wow. That looks great. You don't have too much on your hands. Just a touch, enough <laughs> to look like I've done something. Exactly. So uh, we're just gonna do a little bit of piping on top of the cookie, um, kind of to mimic the lines of the mustache. And if you were to see, look at this card really close, there's some line drawings of different mustache on there, so we're gonna use that as the inspiration, this little background print to do some line work on the mustache, okay? So, we're gonna outline this and give a little, kind of a little curl to it. Do a couple extra lines. Just following that design. You can kind of add as many or as few lines as you like. What if you mess up? Uh, you just start over. <laughs> or we have lots to practice on. Okay. See, so that's kind of basically. Yeah, that looks great. Right. Gets the idea. So I'll let you, so try this. So between your thumb and your forefinger, because you're right-handed, correct? Left. You're left-handed. Uh-huh. Okay, so then between, squeeze it between, all the way between like this. See, I'm gonna hold it like this. Oh! Okay, get all the way in there. Got it. Okay. Ooh. Already got it coming out. Okay, right. so just do a nice outline. Remember, this is kind of tricky. You're doing good. I'm a little panicky about it. No, you're but doing I'm awesome. It. Okay, and then you did a globber right there. And then. Excellent. It's not easy to follow the master. You're doing okay, you great. Did three. Okay. And then on the bottom, you just traced, yep. right? Well, you always had to remind me the rules of lacrosse, so it's it's turnabout <laughs> that I am teaching the rules of, of decorating cookies, I don't right? Know how much you should have listened to me, but yes, absolutely. Okay. okay, is that okay? Yeah, that's awesome. Okay. So see, here's what Carrie did. She's I don't think you've ever used a piping bag before. Right? I have not. Okay, so she admit. did awesome Thank for you. the first time, and we're gonna go ahead and practice on the rest of these, and the, we will show you the finished product in just a moment. Okay, we're back, we're all done. Carrie, what do you think? I love them. Beautiful mustache cookies, beautiful. Yes, I think that we nailed it with the card, don't you? Absolutely, I'm impressed. Perfect. Well, we have some variety here set out, but the most important thing is that Carrie is gonna give these to her neighbor, who's very important to her, and I want her to tell you just a little bit about what we're putting them in. This is a vintage tin that Bernard and I bonded over in the lacrosse stands. We would both bring baked goods to the games, and then when people would see the tin, they would know good food was ahead. So and I wanted to steal it every time. Well, okay. <laughs> I will loan it to you on occasion. We went on eBay to try to find extras. And there were some. There's, there was a few. We just haven't purchased them yet. Okay. Maybe, may, if you're lucky. Yes. If you're so lucky. we're gonna pack these up in this awesome circus tin for her neighbor. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate your help. It was a lot of fun. It was very fun. Thank you, Bernard. Thank you all for watching this video. Please leave your comments at the bottom and subscribe if you want to see more of our cookie videos. Thanks and have a great day. Hey guys, it's Bernard. Welcome back. Today we are going to make some summer fun cookies inspired by this card. My dear friend Candace is going to a pool party soon.